Hey y'all, welcome or welcome back to Official Clarissa on YouTube. You guys can follow me on Instagram, Official Clarissa. I really appreciate y'all for real, for real. So let's go ahead and give y'all a message. Um, let's go ahead and tap in what we got to know about the collective, about y'all, about us. What God wants us to know, what God wants us to clear out, what God wants us to, what, what, what does God want us to know that's that's in the dark that wants to come out to light or that needs to come out to the light? Thank y'all so much for supporting me and staying tuned. All right, let's, let's see what's up with the energy. Somebody here could be traveling, moving away. Somebody here could also be uh moving out. Or they could be scared to move out. Yeah, somebody here could be going to jail for a child. Somebody here could be going to jail for stealing from a child, somebody could be going to jail for touching a child. Six six. Somebody could have got a child pregnant. Freak, yo. Confirmation with a call. What's this nine of pentacles here? Smart could have did a business opportunity or something like that. Smart finna get a child took in because somebody got a child pregnant because they were selling their child for pay. And that's the truth. I mean, and that's, yeah, that is the truth. Because look. Because of a queen of cups. What's this Queen of Cups energy? A liar. Somebody here lying about a family dynamic here. What's this uh, Four of Wands in reverse? Somebody here finna have money issues. What's this Queen of Cups, Four of Wands in reverse? Somebody here gonna have a broken home in a minute. You can sit down and speak your truth on it. There's somebody's sister here that could be lying on a child. That's pregnant. This woman could be pregnant. What's this queen of uh, cubs? Not speaking truth on the queen of swords, possibly, too. They probably would call this person. You probably would have called this person your sister, your homegirl, your best friend or whatever. But this person is betraying you behind your back. And you don't even realize it. Yeah. So this person ain't your friend. This person was a wannabe. Mm-hmm. They could have put a child on you. They could be trying to put the blame on you for something they did to a child. And they stress out about it because they might end up getting caught doing this to a child. Or they could be, uh, this person could be the child. They trying to hold on to some type of money, some type of evidence, some type of proof that they hurt a child, that they put it, made a child pregnant. Somebody could have did some, yeah, Queen of Swords. Somebody could have been saying you raped their child or something, putting false accusations on you and stuff, but it's not true. It could be a Sagittarius. You could be a Queen of Swords. Yeah, things are coming out to the light. These people are not balanced. Yeah, Queen of Wands here. These people got low. They don't. They could have low income. These could have been coworkers or stuff that was working against you because you're independent. You by yourself. They could have been putting out false accusations about you because you're living happy. What's the secrets that these people are big kids and they don't they need to grow up and as well as somebody here could be going towards somebody very fast? What's this nine of swords here? They could be coming towards the collective very fast. Yeah, trying to give to you, trying to give you something after it caused all this chaotic stuff for you, putting on false accusations about you, trying to offer you love, but you walked away from it. What else? Thank you, God. Thank you, God. Yeah, somebody here could be trying to get you pregnant, too. This could be a good man or this could be bad. Ain't no telling. Yeah, somebody here going to take a leap of faith to get you pregnant. You could be this Empress energy. Yeah, King of Wands in reverse. Somebody could be mad. What's this, what's this King of Wands in reverse? 
Yeah, this could be a Gemini or if they trying to get a Gemini pregnant. Yeah, because they have a stability. So this could be an ex-lover. Mm -hmm. They're trying to travel towards you right now, and that's the truth. They're trying to make some type of plan to come towards you and get you pregnant. Or you could just be the empress. You just embody a lot of creativity. Mm -hmm. they try trying to come in and betray you, what I said. Be mindful of this lover trying to come back. I'm hearing, I'm hearing be mindful of the neighborhood. Be mindful of the neighborhood. Because there be, these people could be setting this masculine. Like, they came together and trying to set you up to do this. Yeah, to have a family to live off of you, to leech off of you. 10-10. 6 six. There's a lot of people involved in this. It didn't happen though. You could be in a relationship with a uh, Taurus, or you was. This could be a Taurus Gemini, a uh, Aries Taurus. That's trying to do this. They decided not to let you go. That's trying to give you that big wand that you don't want. Excuse me, y'all. Gotta cleanse myself. I really don't want to get into this energy because I'm tired of this same energy. Let's get some, uh, just go ahead. Okay, I'm gonna just go ahead in this video. I don't want to get into this anymore. I don't want to get into the same energy. I'm tired of the same old energy, bro. But it needs to come out to the light that this person trying to come back to you because it's Mercury retrograde. Yeah, they trying to travel towards you within the next three weeks, three months, three days. They trying to figure out where you live at. They trying to figure out you still dealing with the same person. They're trying to figure out if you get in a divorce, they want it, or they could be going through a divorce, or they want you to go through a divorce. If you are married, they wishing ill will on you. You could be isolated, introverted. You could be to yourself. What's this three of wands here? What's this travel? They probably want you to come towards them. They could be trying to lure you in to, to them, but it ain't working. Now they stressed out about it. Why are they so stressed out? Because what? It's not working. They're trying to hold on to you financially too. But this person has no love for you though. So they're trying to hold on to you financially. They're trying to get that money. This person doesn't love you. And they defensive about it. What? How you, yeah, look. A magician in reverse again. They're defensive because you don't want to work it out with them. You don't want to collab with them. They could want you to collab on a song with them or something. They could be dealing with a whole another fire sign, or they just putting out false accusations and rumors about you, saying that you not attracted. They're not attracted to you anymore, or you whatever. You fake. You a phony. But because you wish, you with your wish for me. You're with your wish for me. And this person mad. Why we keep let learn to let go like this action to let go period to get some guidance first need to let let let, let go let god bro let go yeah ask giving and receive this person want to come in and give and receive to you ask ask us to help you in this situation and we will immediately go to work on your behalf we're governed by many universal laws and among them is the free will that allows you to make your own choices and decisions. We so we patiently await your request. Okay, so I mean, I need to ask God, ask your ancestors, your your um, angels and guardians, whoever watch over you, over you. Ask everybody, sure. Somebody else ancestors could watch over you because what they doing to you. So just ask God, ask them to remove this person from your energy. Ask God to remove this ex from your energy. Ask God to remove whoever's trying to come back into your life. Ask God to remove this person from you energetically, physically, mentally, and spiritually. And in the name of God, in the name of Jesus, I pray. Amen. Okay, I'm going to read this card now. I'm going to end this video. Giving and receiving. 
that um, the entire universe operates in cycles similar to your inhalations. Um, Y'all could be thinking about this person out of nowhere. That's because they're doing magic on you. So just return to sender in the name of God, name of Jesus, and permanently remove this person from your energy. Period. Okay. The entire universe operates in cycles similar to your inhalations and exhalations. I don't know if I said that right. But when you only exhale, give, or only inhale, receive, you will become out of rhythm in the universe for uh, optimal health, energy, and replen replenish replenishment. Balance each inhalation into your life with an and he exhalation exhalation I'm gonna go ahead and end this video y'all thank y'all so much for supporting me and staying tuned I love y'all bye 11 11